asking you to join in with us as we give God the praise. Father God, we thank you. We bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. We come before you, Lord God, just saying thank you, Lord. Thank you for your grace. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for how you keep us, Lord God. Oh, God, we bless your name. There's none like you, none other besides you, Lord God. We praise you, Lord God. We give you glory. We honor you, Lord. Worthy is the Lamb of God, and worthy is your name to be praised. Lord, we love you so much, God. Where will we be without you, Lord God? We just thank you today, God. Thank you, hallelujah, for the joy of the Lord is our strength. Hallelujah, we praise your name, God. To God be the glory for all that you've done, Lord. Oh, God, we just thank you. So much to praise you for, Lord. So much to thank you for. Hallelujah, for a thousand tongues, we couldn't praise your name enough, Lord. For a thousand hands to raise, we couldn't praise your name enough, God. You kept us all week long, God. Hallelujah, you woke us up this morning, hallelujah. Clothed and in our right mind. Hallelujah, you said activity of our lips, Lord God. Oh God, we praise you, we praise you, we praise you, we praise you. We bless your name, Jesus. Uh, hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, Lord God. Uh, we just bless your name. Hallelujah. Thank you for saving us when you did, Lord God. Uh, you never gave up on us, oh God. Uh, hallelujah. You were there all the time. Hallelujah. Oh God, we just praise your name. We praise you name Jesus. Uh, have your way in this place today, Lord God. Uh, move by your spirit, Lord God. Uh, let not one go back the way that they came in, Lord God. Uh, but take us higher, Lord God. Uh, take us higher in you, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah. You said seek your face, God. Uh, and we come today seeking your face, Lord God. Uh, we come today, oh God, uh, to hear what you have to say to us, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah, Jesus. Uh, Oh, worthy Lamb of God. Uh, hallelujah. We bless your name, Jesus. Uh, we thank you, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah, Jesus, for a made up mind, Lord God, uh, to live for you, Lord God. Uh, we thank you, Lord God, uh, for your healing power, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah, Jesus. Uh, you are the King of kings. Uh, you are the Lord of lords. Uh, there's none like you, Lord God. Uh, no one beside you, Lord God. God, uh, we praise you, Lord God, uh, for joy down in our souls, Lord. Uh, we praise you, Lord God, uh, for peace in our minds, Lord God. Uh, we praise you, Lord God. Uh, so much to praise you for, Lord. Uh, so much to thank you for, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah, Jesus. Uh, we lift our eyes unto the hills. Uh, the winds come in our help, oh Lord. Uh, all of our help come from you, Lord. Uh, which made heaven and earth, Lord. Uh, we thank you, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah, Jesus. Uh, hallelujah, hallelujah. More love to thee, Lord God. Uh, more love to thee, Lord. Uh, increase us, Lord. Uh, hallelujah, the things of you, Lord God. Uh, hallelujah, restore that witch, Lord. Uh, the canker worm and the palmer worm have eaten away, Lord. Uh, the cares of this life, Lord God. Uh, we came today, Lord God, uh, for a fresh anointing, Lord God. Uh, we came today, Lord God. Uh, Fill us again, Lord God. Fill us again, Lord. Fill us with your glory, God. Fill us with your power, Lord God. Fill us, hallelujah. Let it overflow, Lord God. That when we leave this place, Lord God, and when we go to our prospective jobs on tomorrow, let the Holy Ghost shine in us, oh God. Let the Holy Ghost move in us, Lord. Let the Holy Ghost, hallelujah, shine brightly in us, Lord. Hallelujah, that men may ask, what must I do to be saved? Oh, God, help us to be real, Lord. And all we do is say, help us, oh, God. You get the glory, Lord. You get the glory, Lord. You get the glory, Lord. Out of our lives, Lord. Now, God, let the weak say I'm strong. Help the strong to bear the infirmity of the weak, Lord. Oh, God, put us in that place, Lord. 
Lord. Put us in that place, Lord, where you will have us to be, Lord. Hallelujah. We pray for those that are at home, Lord. We pray, oh God. Hallelujah for our mothers of Zion, Lord. We pray today, God. You said in your word, Lord, with long life will you satisfy them and show them your salvation. We pray for the elders, Lord. We pray for the elderly men, Lord. We pray, God. We call their name, God, one by one, and name by name, God. God, increase. Hallelujah, we decree and we declare increase in our lives. We pray for this body of believers in the name of Jesus. We pray for our city. Oh God, we pray for our city. We pray for our state, Lord. And we pray for our nation. You told us, oh God, to seek your face, oh God. Hallelujah. We only take you, oh God. Hallelujah. The word that you've given us, oh God, to stand upon, Lord. Hallelujah. We stand today, oh, hallelujah, if they believe in uh, that it's already done, uh, that it's already done, uh, that it's already done, uh, done of the Father, done of the Son, uh, done of the Holy Ghost, uh, move, Lord, uh, in this house today, Lord, uh, move, Lord, uh, like never before, God, uh, let your fire fall, Hamashiach, let your fire fall, God. Let your fire fall, God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Let your fire fall, God. Every song, hallelujah, that's sung under the anointed, hallelujah. Every hand that's raised, Lord, hallelujah. Receive our praises. Receive our praises. Receive our praises, God. Receive our praises, God. Oh, God. And we thank you. We thank you, Lord. So much to praise you for. So much to thank you for. We give you glory. We give you honor. Hallelujah. 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 Touch those. Hallelujah. That are home and that are lying upon their bed even right now. Give them new strength, Lord, uh, like never before. Uh, hallelujah. We touch and agree with them uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, that healing belongs to them. Uh, hallelujah. Deliverance belongs to them. Uh, hallelujah, Jesus. Uh, we thank you today. Thank you for every musician, God. Uh, thank you today, oh God. Uh, just move in this house God move in this house God we receive your glory we receive your honor we receive your power hallelujah Jesus come on saints lift your hands and give him glory he's worthy to be praised he's worthy to be praised he's worthy to be praised He's worthy to be praised. We give you glory. Higher than a Oh, God. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Oh, bless your name, Jesus. Praise the Lord, everybody. Come on, give God praise. Amen. Come on, praise him. We thank God. Amen for the prayer. Amen. We're going to go real quick to Psalms 150. Amen. Psalms 150. Amen. Come on. Praise ye the Lord. Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him with the firmament of his power. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him with the sound of the trumpet. Praise him with a pulsarian heart. Praise him with the, excuse me, with the timbre and dance. Praise him with, the, with his string instruments and organs. Praise him upon the loud sounding cymbals. Praise him with the high sounding cymbals. Let everything that has breath Praise ye the Lord. Amen. Come on, we thank God for the word on today. Hallelujah. 
Praise the Lord Empowerment. Oh, come on, you can do better than that. Praise the Lord Empowerment. How many glad to be in the house of God today? Hallelujah. I'm here to do the daily confession. If you don't have it, the ushers will be more than happy to pass it out. And the daily confession reads, my body is a temple of the Holy Spirit, redeemed, cleansed, and sanctified by the blood of Jesus. My members, the parts of my body, are instruments of righteousness, yielded to God for his services and his glory. The devil has no place in me, no power over me, and no unsettled claims against me. All has been settled by the blood of Jesus. I overcome Satan by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of my testimony. I love not my life until the death. My body is for the Lord and the Lord is for my body. Can you just clap your hands in this place? Hallelujah. Come on and give him glory all over this place. Praise the Lord, everybody. So praise the Lord, everybody. Can you begin to clap your hands all over this building? Come on, somebody just clap your hands and give him praise wherever you are. If you're watching online, can you just lift up a sound of praise? Come on, everybody, just open up your mouth and give him glory. He deserves this and more. Come on, somebody raise your voice and give him praise all over this place. He deserves all the glory. He woke us up this morning, started us on our way. He gave us another chance. Can you look at your neighbor and tell him, neighbor, I came to bless the Lord with everything that I have. If you came to bless the Lord, can you just stand to your feet with us? And can you just give him, him great praise all over the building? Great is the Lord and greatly to be praised. Before we sing any song, can we just lift up a shout of praise in the building? I said, can we lift up a shout of praise in this building? Come on, somebody raise up a shout of praise. He deserves all the glory and honor. They were said, I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. And since we're here, we might as well give him praise for waking us up, for starting us on our way, for giving us the breath of life, for giving us another chance. He didn't have to do it, but he did. And because he did, he deserves all praise. All glory and all honor. Somebody lift up a shout of praise. You could have been dead. You shouldn't even be here. But the fact that you're here shows that God is working miracles, signs and wonders. If you believe it like I do, lift your voice and shout hallelujah. Lift your voice and shout hallelujah. We're going to talk about how great our God is. Look at your neighbor, tell him he's great, he's great, he's great. Come on, come on, everybody clap your hands like this. Come on, clap your hands, everybody. Come on, everybody clap your hands right here. Come on, everybody clap your hands. Anybody love Jesus in the building? Come on, right here, let's go. Hey, we love to call your name in something. We can now get explained that hell of much when we proclaim your great name, your great name said call your name. Call your name. Come on everybody, let's get up. We can now explain that when we proclaim. Come on, lift it up. Your great name. No other. No other name. Not stronger. Everything changes. When we call. Come on, everybody, clap your hands right here. Come on, clap, clap, clap. Come on, everybody, look to the real out. Say, we love to. Call your name. Yes, Lord. We cannot explain, though. That happens. that happens when we proclaim. When we Let's do it again. Your grace. Your grace. Come on. Say, we love to call your name. Call your name. We cannot explain. That happens 
when we broke. Oh God's people, let's lift it up. Say, Your brain, say, Kick Jesus, Kick. I need you to get loose today. The name King Jesus, not stronger, not stronger. Everything changed. When we call on your Come on, everybody, lift it up. Come on. Sing, King Jesus. King Jesus. No other. No other Jesus. All the praises, lift it up. We can call on Everything changes. Let's do it again. Sing it again. Sing it again. Sing, King Jesus. No other. No other oh. Everything has to change, yeah. One more time, everybody. Lift it up. Come on, say it. Say, King Jesus. Oh, oh, no other. Not Not stronger. Cry your hands, yeah. Everything changed. Oh, Lord. Come on, everybody. Lift it up. Come on, everybody. Say it. There is power in the name of Jesus. Power in the name. Do I have a believer out there? Come on, lift it up. There is power in the name of Jesus. So much power in the name. All God's people, lift it up and say it loud. There is power in the name of Jesus. Come on, lift it up, say. Come on, everybody, lift it up real loud, say. Everybody believe it. Power Come on, let's do it again. The there is power in the name. There is power in the name of So Jesus. much power in the name. Power in the name. All God's people lift it up real loud. Say. There is power in the name. If you're on your couch, lift it up. There is power. Power in the name. Build it up. There is power in the name. Say. There is power in the name of Jesus. There is power. Come on, lift it up. There is power in. There is power in the name of Jesus. Come on, lift it up. Say it. Sing big change when we call. Sing big change when we call you. Sing big change when we call you. I need all the praises on your feet. Lift it up. Say it. Lift it up. Say it. See, I'm free with you. I'm free when I call you, Jesus. I'm free when I call you. See, I'm free when I call you, Jesus. I'm free when I call you. Come on, look it up. See, I'm free when Some praise in the building. I'm free with. I'm free when I call Come on, lift it up. Hey, say when I call your name. When I call your name. Lift it up. When I call your name. When I call your name. I feel my shaking when I call. When I call your name. When I call your. Let's go. When I call your name. Hey, I'm free when I'm free with. Come on, lift it up. I'm free. When I'm free with when I call your name. Feel my helping when I come. When I call your name. Come on, day. all God's people lift it up real loud. Say. When I call hey, your hey, day. I feel my shaking when I come. When I call your hey, name. I feel my freedom when I come. When I call your name. I'm alive when I call your name. When I call your name. When I call your name. Three parts. When I call your name, 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 when I call your name. I wish I had all the praises in the praise team lifted up. When I call your name, when I call your name, when I call your name. I feel my breakthrough when I call. I feel my freedom when I call. When I call oh, your oh, name. When I call your name. Hey, let everybody clap your hands like this. 
Does anybody feel freedom in the room? Do you feel freedom in the room? When we call on the great name, something has to change. Something has to shift. I need every believer to lift it up real loud. Come on, say it. When I call your name. 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 I'll feel my breakthrough when I call. When I call your name. When I call your name. When I call your name. I want to say it. Hey. Say, we call that great name. Come on, lift it up. Come on, say, when I call your name, when I call your name, say, when I call your name, 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 feel my bright new. When I call your name, when I call your name, now somebody begin to lift Jesus higher. Come on, everybody clap your hands right here. Come on, everybody clap your hands right here. Everything has to change. When we call the name of Jesus, something has to change. The name that has all power, the name that has all authority. When we call the greatest name, tell me who can stand before us. When we call on the greatest name, not cancer, not disease, not sickness, not even my flesh. Come on, lift it up. When I, come on everybody say, when I call your name. 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 When I call your name, three parts. Say it. When I call your name. 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 Come on. Everybody clap your hands. Come on. Clap. Clap your hands. There was freedom in his name. There was liberty in his name. Let's do it one more time. Come on, lift it up. See, when I call your name. When I call your name. Yeah, somebody lift up the greatest name in the building. We might as well take it there. Somebody lift up the greatest name in the building. I don't care what you're going through. I don't care what situation that you're facing. I don't care what the doctor says. I don't care what the world says. I don't care what the news says. Jesus is the king. And as long as he reigns upon the throne, as long as he reigns upon the throne, as long as he rules upon the throne, I don't have nothing to worry about. Look at your neighbor real quick. I know you can't touch him, tell him. I have nothing to worry about. That was the wrong person. Look at somebody to tell him. I have nothing to worry about. Tell them I have nothing to worry about. Tell me who can stand before us when we call the greatest name. Somebody lift up the greatest name right here. Come on, somebody begin to lift up the greatest name. The name that has all power. The name that has all authority. The name that has all strength. The name who's never failed. <laughs> I've tried drugs, I've tried medicine, I've tried so many things, but Jesus has never failed. I wish I had a believer, I wish I had an old school believer that no, Jesus would never fail. He would never fail, he would never, just look at somebody else and point to him, like you got the Holy Ghost and tell him, he has never failed, and he never will. I wish I had a praiser in here. Touch somebody and tell him he would never fail. He has never failed. And he never. 
He never, come on, come on, drive it out here. He never will. I'm going to wait till y'all believe it. I'm not going to keep provoking y'all, but if you look back over your life and see what he's brought you through, you can see what he's brought you through. You was in a dirty pit. You was stuck in some situations that you couldn't get out of. But it was Jesus that brought you out with the triumph and the testimony. It was Jesus that picked you up. Somebody begin to turn around right here. Somebody begin to turn around right here. It was Jesus that picked up with the Holy Ghost. I feel the Holy Ghost moving right here. It was Jesus that brought you out. It was Jesus that picked me up and he turned me around and he placed my feet. He placed my feet. I was sinking deep in sin. Far from the peaceful soul. Very deeply stained within. Sinking to rise no more. Blood the master. Who is this master? Who is this master? I'm talking about Jesus. He heard my despair cry. And from the waters, from the waters, he lifted me. Trust somebody to say, look at me now. Trust somebody to say, look at me now. I know last year I looked crazy. I know yesterday I was sinking. Yesterday I was stressed out. But weeping may, weeping may, weeping may, and do for a night. But I got joy. When did it come? When did it come? It came in the morning. It's about noon time right now. But this is the moment to praise for what you already got. This is your moment to praise for. This is your moment to praise for what you already got. When I think of the goodness. See, y'all making me work crazy. But somebody should be running. Somebody should be dancing. Somebody should be going crazy. When I think of the goodness of Jesus and all he's done for me. I'm gonna let my soul cry just now. I'm gonna let my feet testify to what he's done. I said, I'm gonna let my feet testify to what he's done. I need all the praises to hit the floor. One, two, everybody, this right here. Come on, hey, hey, come on, your head. I like that tempo right there. Come on, come on, everybody, come on, your head. Everybody come here with him. Woo! Everybody praise right here. I wish I had ten radical praises. That don't mind giving him glory. Cause he's brought you through March. He's carried you over to April. He's giving you grace in, in May. He's giving you favor in June. He's giving you prosperity in July. He's giving you blessings in August. September. He's giving you miracles. October, he's giving you favor. Over in November, I got a crazy praise. I got a crazy praise. I need 10 people right now to hit the floor. Come on, hey, one, two, everybody dance right here. Hey, hey, come on, come on. I need you to hit the floor right here. Come on, everybody clap. Let it sound like an old school church. Everybody clap, yo. I wish I'd get crazy. One, two, 
Those should have took me over. But the real remedy stepped in, and his name was Jesus. <laughs> I thought I had a praiser right there. Tell your neighbor, this is the reason why I praise him. When friends and family turned their back on me, he was right there. Tell your neighbor, this is the reason why I praise him. Because when they counted me out, Jesus counted me in. Tell your neighbor this is the reason why I praise him. Tell your neighbor this is the reason why I praise him. Tell your neighbor this is the reason why I praise him. Just because he's Jesus. And if that don't provoke you right there, woe well to you. But if you can't praise him for who he is, I'm sorry, get off my road. Don't call me, but I need 10 praises. That don't mind jumping up and praising him for who he is. Not for what he's done, but for who he is. Everybody praise right here just for who he is. Everybody praise just for who he is. Come on. Everybody just for who he is. I give him glory, not for stuff, but for who he is. I give him glory, not for what he's done, but just for who he is. Just for who he is. Just for who he is. Miracle worker. Good. Promise keeper. Say. Mary's baby. Say. Just for who he is. Just for who he is. I praise just for who he is. 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 Thank you. 
So everybody clap your hands, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Has it been good? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Has it been good? His presence in this place and I know you can feel his presence it's not just the heat it's not just the warm November weather it's somebody say it's the presence of the Lord it is the presence of the Lord the song says surely the presence of the Lord is in this place and I would not amen I would not amen take too much time your time this afternoon, but I would, even if I were to preach to you and be honor, 
Amen. The spirit of the Lord in this place. We honor the Lord for our overseer. Amen. Our elder Curtis in his absence. To our first lady. Amen. To Pastor Stacy and to our children and to all of our ministers, those here and those, amen, not here to, amen, to, amen, our birthday celebrants, amen, in this month, amen, to our elder Hicks, amen, just celebrated his birthday on yesterday, amen, our first lady is celebrating her birthday all month, amen, period, amen, (laughs) amen, to all those that are celebrating, amen, we celebrate you, amen, and we are excited, somebody shout excited. Amen. Because God is yet working miracles. Amen. Somebody just lift your hands and shout, I receive my miracle. Amen. If if I could tell you, amen, what the Lord has done, amen, it would literally blow your mind. Amen. But what I will tell you is that, amen, I placed a need before him. Amen. And I'm going to tell you, amen, am I not, amen, I am not, amen, amen, at liberty to Amen. Release to you what the Lord has done. Amen. But I put a petition before God. Amen. And God has not only met the need. Amen. But he has exceeded the need. Amen. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. And I I, I say it like the old folks say, who won't serve a God like this? Amen. Who won't serve, amen, a God like this? Amen. And every time I turn around, Amen. As the song says, God keeps on blessing. Amen. As I look, amen, and I showed up, amen, to the house and to the sanctuary yesterday, amen, a young man met us, amen, and before we knew it, amen, the steps were being painted, amen. Look at God, amen, the things that we didn't have to ask for, amen, but somebody wanted to do it out of the kindness of their heart, amen, to be a blessing to the house of God. Amen. We had some other issues, amen, dealing with the trees, amen, the the surrounding, amen, of the sanctuary. Before I can walk into the sanctuary this morning, amen, a neighbor from behind, amen, came and said, Pastor, amen, I've been trying to get in contact with you, amen, because of some things that I wanted to do concerning the trees, amen. And if we had to do it, amen, it would have cost, amen, roughly, amen, close to around $20,000, amen. But he said to me this morning, would you mind if I took care of it? And I said, you know what? Go ahead and have your way. You can go ahead and do what you want to do. Amen. I I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. If there's anything else you see fit that you'd like to do, amen, please, by all means, have your way. Amen. And so we are in awe when we moved into this facility, when we moved into this building. Amen. We deem this as what? Our place of favor. Amen. And regardless, amen, to where we are, regardless to what we are experiencing, amen, God says you have to remind him. Somebody shall remind him. Remind him at his word. Amen. And if I were to say anything to you this afternoon, amen, it would be for you to remind God at his word. How many are standing on the promises of God? Amen. We've been waiting for God to fulfill his promises over our lives. We've been hearing promises. Prophecy after prophecy, and these aren't in my notes, amen, but I feel led to remind somebody that he is a promise keeper. Somebody just shout, he is a promise keeper, amen, and every word that God has spoken concerning your life, he shall bring it to pass. I need you to just put your hand over your head and say, he is a promise keeper. He is a promise keeper. As a matter of fact, the Bible declares that every word that comes out of his mouth shall not return unto him void, but it shall accomplish that which it has been set out for it to do. In other words, it will accomplish. It will come back to him saying, mission completed. Somebody say, say it will complete that which it was supposed to do. It will come back successful. It will, it will, it will come back successful. It will, as a matter of fact, some of you are still standing, amen, on words that have been, amen, uh, 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 diagnosed over you, amen, at the beginning, at the onset of this year. I'm here to let you know that in spite of what has been spoken over your life this year, amen, on the downside, that God is getting ready to turn things around. Somebody shout, I receive a turnaround. 
I receive a turnaround. I receive a turnaround. I believe, amen, I believe, amen, that somebody is getting ready to walk into a divine turnaround. You are getting ready to walk into a divine turnaround. As a matter of fact, I speak a divine exchange over your life right now. Lift your hands and receive this prophetic word. You're getting ready to walk into a divine exchange. What is a divine exchange? Every time you come into the presence of the Lord and you lift up your hands as a sign of, of sacrifice, as a sign of surrenderance, it's not just a sign of you lifting your hands because this is something that we do, but it is a sign of you offering sacrifice. It's a sign of you lifting up your burden. It's a sign of you lifting up your care. It's a sign of you saying that in spite of what I'm dealing with, I still lift up what I have as an offering unto God and I'm sacrificing this weight and this care unto him and I'm lifting it up in exchange for the blessing that God has for me. I need somebody to take about 30 seconds and just remember what it is that you had to deal with over the last seven days and offer it up as a divine exchange because what he has on the other side of what you're going through for I reckon that the suffering of this present time are not worthy to be compared to the glory there is a divine exchange on the other side of this worship and it's only going to take you about 30 seconds I need somebody to tap in right here right here right here right here right here come on lift up those hands lift up those hands right here there's a divine exchange on the other side of this lift up those hands open up your mouth and offer up the sacrifice of worship Come on, that's it, that's it. I'm trading my sorrow. I'm trading my shame. And I'm laying it down for the joy of the Lord. Come on, I'm trading it all away. For a divine exchange. And my answer is yes. 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 It's the law. It's the law of the Lord. You can offer him anything and leave empty handed. You can offer him anything. I'm done. It's not, this is not what I was preaching, but it's in my spirit. You, you can't offer him anything in sincerity and leave Hicks empty-handed. When, when the Bible declares that when Abram, when Abraham had to offer his son, and when he went to the mountain, he told the servants, leave me and my son, for we're ascending or we're going up to do what? To worship. Even his son knew and said to him, Father, where is the sacrifice? And has said to his son, the Lord God will do what? Will provide a sacrifice. And he got all the way to the mountain. You know the story. And when he went to slay his son to offer up the sacrifice, the spirit of the Lord God spoke to him and said, Abraham, Abraham, slay not your son. For the Lord has provided you a sacrifice. And when he turned around, what was there? There was a ram stuck in the bush. For once he was ready to offer up the sacrifice, that's when God had provided right in the nick of time. Somebody lift up your hands. Because I heard the Lord say, that this blessing and this miracle is getting ready to overtake your sacrifice. You've been getting ready and you've been sacrificing and you've been doing this. I heard the Lord say, many of you have been sacrificing on empty. You have been doing it and you have been doing it just because this is something that you have been doing over and over and over for years. But the Lord said, because you've made it, 
into this house on this day, the Lord said that I am getting ready to open up the windows of heaven and pour you out such blessing that you will have room enough to receive. Lift up your hands, open up your mouth. The blessing is coming out before you get ready to make your sacrifice. All you've got to do is make your way to the altar. Be ready to make the sacrifice. Who's willing to ascend to the heavenlies? Who's willing to go to the high place? All I need is a willing vessel. All I need is a willing vessel. If you provide, if you provide the vessel, I'll provide the sacrifice. All I need is for you to go. All I need is for you to go. All I need is for you to go. He says, all I need, he says, all I need is for you to go. <laughs> Pastor Stacy, all I need is for you to go. Don't worry about what other folks don't understand. Leave them behind. Folks that mean well. Folks that have been with you all the while. Folks that have enjoyed the journey with you. In order for you to ascend into this next level or into this next dip, dim, what is it? dimension in God or this next dimension of grace, you're going to have to leave some people behind. in order for you to ascend into this next level of ministry some folks are going to have to stay behind I know it's your desire not only to ascend into this next level but to bring your whole camp up that's what we do that's what we do we bring everybody up with us but in this season God says I'm getting ready to surround you around a whole new group of people it's not that you can't bring them up it's not that you can't be a blessing to them but in this season all they're going to do is hold you down in this season it's time for you to separate yourself and come out from among them and be ye separated and conform yourself not unto the unclean thing but cause yourself to be ye holy and separated unto God And when you get there, and when you get there, when you get there, your life will speak volumes to what God has done. Let your life speak for you. Let your life speak for you. Don't go bankrupt trying to bail everybody out. But let your life speak for you. Hicks, lift your hands. This last sickness was meant to take you out. Because I heard the Lord say 2021 is getting ready to be the biggest increase that your business has ever seen. We speak to the financial hold that's been over your life and we cause it to be released right now in the name of Jesus to this financial debt, to this financial demon that has caused itself to run rapid over your life. Be now, release now. Somebody shout now. Somebody shout divine exchange. You gotta get out of here. You gotta go. You gotta go. I gotta get out of here. 
Somebody lift up your hands one more time. Just say, Lord, I release it to you. Lord, I release it to you. Chase, I think I did meet you before, didn't I? I did meet you before. Lift up both your hands, man. Lift them up. Say it. Release it to you, Lord. Say, I, Lord, I release it to you. I want you to hear everything I said today. I want you to hear everything I said today. I want you to eat it all up. Eat it all up. Figuratively. Because the enemy is after your soul. The enemy is after your soul. And watch what the enemy does as soon as you leave here. He's going to come in to contradict every word that was spoken in this house. I just want you to say it one time and it settles it forever in heaven. The devil is a liar. We gotta go. I want, come on, stand to your feet. We gotta go. That's, that's my time. Can we say this one more time? Lord, I release it to you. Lord, I release it to you. The power of your release is so important because when you're holding on to so much, it holds you down. It holds, a, Brother Dion, it holds you back. It holds you from reaching your full potential. And it's not only literally, but it's also spiritually, Jackie. We hold ourselves back, Sister Brittany, from really pushing forward and many times if we're honest with ourselves sister paula it's not other people overseer that are holding us back but stefan it's it's ourselves that are keeping us from really moving forward we have all these ideas we have all these 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 innovative th thoughts but because we have these other issues sideline issues that we think that we're not good enough and we think about our families and we think about uh, 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 our education, we, we, we begin to push our own selves back and say, we're going to wait another year. Let me get my finances right. Let me get my credit right. But how many know there's nothing like the favor of God? I'll say that again. How many know that there's nothing like the favor of God? Amen. If it wasn't for the favor of God, you wouldn't be working the job that you're in. If it wasn't for the favor of God, you wouldn't be driving the car that you're driving. Amen. If it wasn't for the favor of God, we wouldn't be in this building that we're in right now. Amen. Somebody shout hallelujah. Amen. When we think about many of the things that, amen, we have right now, we just have to lift up our hands and thank God for his favor. Amen. So I want you one more time, amen, without any wrath or without any doubt, I want you to take 60 seconds. Amen. Brother DJ, just give us some nice worship music. Amen. And we're going to just take 60 seconds and we're going to go into our offering. I just want you to lift up your hands and I want you to thank God for release. Lord, we thank you for release. Come on, come on. Take your seats in the presence of the Lord. We thank God. We praise and we thank God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, we thank you. 
Oh, glory to God. Thank you. Somebody's getting out of their own way this week. Come on, I said somebody's getting out of their own way this week. Come on, I said somebody's getting out of their own week the way this week. Hallelujah. blessed by, as we've been blessed continually by the music ministry of Minister Kentrell Reagan and our wonderful praise team singers and to our wonderful musician, Brother Dion and Brother DJ and what's this young man's name? Huh? Javen? Brother Javen? Come on, give God praise for this young man stepping in for us last minute as Sister Patricia had to work a double. Amen. And we thank God for all of you being with us this afternoon, those of our online view and audience, and amen, those of you listening, amen, in our conference line. And now we are giving you all an opportunity to join in with us in another portion of our worship experience. Amen. You can join in with us with our offering uh, experience this afternoon. And we all have an opportunity, amen, to help us continue to spread the gospel, amen, not only here, Amen. But throughout our city, throughout our state, amen, and throughout the nation, amen. We're asking those, amen, if you continue to be a blessing, amen, as we have our need, amen, with our furnace in our basement, amen. Those, amen, we have made the, uh, the clarion call to those who have made your pledge, amen. We're asking those to continue to do so as you continue to make your pledge payment. Amen. As we try to figure out how to configure, amen, the online system, amen, we're asking you to make your online payment through texting, amen, to do so 
by submitting it through the AC system. When you submit it through the AC system, we will automatically change it on the back system to furnace. Amen? Amen. So if you submit your furnace pledge, submit it under AC system. Unless you're doing it in person, amen, one of the trustees will automatically fix it for you. But if you're doing it on our online system or through texting, we ask that you do it, amen, under the AC system. And one of the trustees will automatically change it to furnace. Amen? Amen. And for those of you that are continuing, amen, to make your tithing, your love offering, and your first fruit uh, gift, vision seed gifting, amen, we appreciate your gifts every week. Amen. For it is your gifts that continue to allow us to continue to do ministry on the scale that we're able to do so. Amen. We've been able to continue to keep our lights on, to keep our heat on, amen, to purchase new computers, to purchase cameras, amen, to keep our system on, to continue to pay our musicians. Hello, somebody. Amen. And, and to continue to, uh, amen, just to continue to walk into a building. Amen. Amen. So we want you to continue to do so. Amen. As we will continue to do the will of the Lord. Amen. Amen. We also have Thanksgiving coming up. If you are aware of any families that are in need of Thanksgiving items, please, please let Sister Jackie know. Amen. Sister Jackie, for those of you that are here, is right over there. Amen. For those of you online, please, amen, inbox her. Amen. To let her know of any families that you know that are in need, amen, of Thanksgiving items. And we will make sure to have, to get, amen, the items over to them right away for Thanksgiving. I believe we're trying to bless at least a minimum of five families. Amen. So please, please, my brother, my sisters, please let Sister Jackie know. Amen. I believe no later than next week. Amen. That way we have plenty of time to get whatever items are needed. Amen? Amen. I believe that is all for announcements. Amen. Please govern yourselves accordingly. For those that are sewing, of course, we forgot to make those announcements. Amen. You can do so right now by texting the word empowerment to 73256. Again, you can text the word empowerment to 73256. It's immediately going to text you back and you can follow the texting prompts. Amen. You can also go to our website, empowermentcct.org. Empowermentcct.org and then click on our online giving tab and follow the giving prompts. If not, you can mail in your giving seed to our Empowerment Christian Church offices right here at the Empowerment Christian Church at 79 Lawrence Street in the city of New Haven, Connecticut, 06511. My brothers and sisters, there is no seed too great and there is no seed too small. Little becomes much when you place it in the master's hand. I believe that is all for them. <laughs> you bet. Come on, stay to your feet. You bet. <laughs> Come on and stand to your feet as we get ready. God a hand praise. The presence of the Lord is in this place. Amen. And we just want to say thank you all for coming, taking time out of your busy schedule to come by ECC. We praise God for our man of God. Amen. Pastor Corey R. Salisbury. Amen. Saints, he turned 37 this week. I had to go to him this morning and say, um, let me look at you to make sure you look 37. Amen. But we just thank God for our pastor and for how even doing this, all this, this COVID stuff that's going on, amen, he's been able to maintain. Amen. And if you knew how much he worked, amen, that we can be a part of ministry, whether we come or whether we watch at home, we're just excited about how the Lord is using him. And I thank God for each and every 
one of you. So at this time, we're asking, amen, we're going to sing happy birthday. And those of you that got the Those of you that got the <laughs> that got the message, Amen. We're asking everyone to present him with the card, and if you didn't get the message, Amen. Um, you can give him uh, something in his hand because he deserves it, Amen. So we're asking. No gift is too small, but we're asking everyone if you can at least give thirty-seven dollars. <laughs> $37. I have two cards in my purse. Amen. Those of you who want to present it to our pastor, spread the word. Those of you that are at home, amen, you can mail your gift in to 79 Lawrence Street here in the city of New Haven, 06511. Amen. In care of the Empowerment Christian Church. Amen. He prays for us and you can see how, how uh, awesome the anointing uh, falls when he ministers. And I'm glad I'm his mama, but I praise God, amen, for the anointing in our lives. Those of you that have the cards, you may come now. Amen. special cake for our pastor. You all can go down and receive uh, cake on your way out the door. Amen. Amen. Come on, stand to your feet and let's bless him. In so Ooh. Leave it to Keisha. That's his sister. <laughs> Come on, stand to your feet. We get ready to go. <laughs> say, Leave it to Keisha. <laughs> Amen. Come on, let's say Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you.